The Gospel of Jesus Christ is about discipleship. Jesus said, go into all the world and make disciples of all nations. A disciple is a follower of Jesus Christ. A disciple follows Jesus Christ himself. And Jesus will take you onto the streets. He will take you any place to go and preach the gospel. But he will not take you to church, my friend. Because if you are a disciple of Christ, you yourself are the body of Christ. And Jesus said, if I be lifted up, then I will draw men unto me. So when you lift Jesus up, he draws people to him. You don't start the church. You become the body of Christ. And you bring other people into active service in the body of Christ. It is not a club business. These clubs and churches are stagnant. They are dead. They are devoid of Christ. Because they are groups with their own values. And those are not the values of Christ, my friend. The values of Christ are discipleship values. When you join a group, you take on the values of that group. And by golly, if you just violate the group values, then you are out. Then they say to you, fit in or ship out. And that's what church does. Fit in or ship out. And that is why Jesus Christ does not fit into a church, because he is God Almighty. And that is why we are not to build churches, but to make disciples of Christ, who in turn will make more disciples. My friend, if you cannot follow Jesus Christ on your own, you never will. It's not about groups. It's not about clubs. Clubs take you the wrong place. Jesus takes you onto the lonely road. My message, which is the message of Jesus Christ, is not work, welcome in churches. Because they are not about Christ, they are about our church. My message is also not welcome in these Christian channels. Why? Because they've got their own values. They censor my messages. My videos are censored before they go onto these Christian channels. And they chuck out some of them because they don't want the truth in there. It's like a church. They don't want the truth in there. They don't want Christ in there. Everything is tailored to their little doctrine. It's got to go through their cemetery. Or should I say their seminary. And Jesus Christ doesn't go to seminary, my friend. And if you follow Jesus Christ, you are not put into a box. These churches think that they have put God into a box. Their church is a box here, a coffin, where they box people and they ship them to hell. My friend, you've got to follow Jesus Christ, be a disciple and make disciples. Don't become part of some group. As soon as a group gets a name, it becomes exclusive. And it excludes the truth and it excludes Jesus Christ. Walking with Jesus Christ is a lonely road. Jesus sent out one or two. He didn't make them groups. They went out and they proclaimed the gospel of Jesus Christ. You walk with Jesus, you're going to walk alone. You're going to find some guys that will walk along with you for a while. And then you, you speak the truth and they get offended. And they walk away. Now what are you going to do? You're going to try and please the brother. Or you're going to tell him the truth because you love him. And you want him to follow Jesus Christ. My friend, the truth has no friends. The truth has no fellowship. The fellowship of the truth is Jesus Christ and him alone. If we follow Jesus, we must be prepared to be alone most of the walk. Most of the way, because it's a lonely road. And Jesus walked that lonely road. You're not going to fit into churches. You're not going to fit into these groups. They will quickly excommunicate you. Because if you speak the word of God, they're going to fear you and they're going to hate you. Why? Because they feared Jesus and they hated him and they excluded him. My friends, 
it is a lonely road to walk with Jesus Christ. You do not fit into groups and into churches. They are secular organizations run by people for those people. You follow Jesus Christ, it's a lonely road like that. When Jesus called one man, he said, Lord, let me just first go. I want to go bury my brother or my father. And Jesus said to you, let the dead go bury their own dead. My friend, if you walk with Christ, it is a lonely walk. Don't expect to have many friends on the road. But you will go on the road. You won't go into these little churches and sit in pews. God will take you into the road, onto the streets, onto the secular channels. Not to become worldly. Not to become conformed to the world. But to let your light shine. These churches have got no light. They are dead and dark. They're bringing the devil in there. With all their influences. They've got these rock bands. And they are dancing and having parties. And they're glorifying Satan. Instead of Jesus Christ the Lord of Lords and the King of Kings. My friend if you walk with Jesus you walk alone. You don't become part of a, of a church or a club. You become part of the body of Christ. And the body of Christ reaches out. It doesn't build little buildings and little monuments to the glory of people. No. It goes out and it brings in people into the kingdom of God, to the glory of God. You're going to be walking alone. A man of God walks alone. You're not part of a group, my friend. You're part of the body of Christ, which is exclusive to Christ. It doesn't belong to any group. Jesus Christ is Lord. Either you belong to Jesus or you belong to some group. You cannot serve two masters, my friend. Come out from there. Want us follow Jesus? Come out of there. Don't take on group values. Take on Christ's values. And then you will be persecuted. You will be rejected. But you will walk in righteousness and in truth. Because you're walking with Christ. You won't have the approval of men. But you will walk in the approval of God, my friend. And he will look after you. Seek the kingdom of God and his righteousness, my friend. And all the other things will be added unto you. And you will be in the peace of God. Don't seek to be approved by men and accepted by men. Because then you will be rejected by God. May Jesus bless you.